Skateboarding without the effort! <laughs> okay, hold tight! <laughs> What is it, Nasha? Oi! Hooligan! What? Guess what? I found the ideal material for our new kitchen curtains. Look. Oh, yes. Very nice, dear. And it was the very last piece they had. It's perfect. I'll have my dream kitchen at last. Oh, you haven't got far with the painting, though, have you? I'm taking extra special care, dear. You can't rush a good job, you know. Hmm. All right. I'll go and look for curtain rails. Bye! <sighs> One other thing, dear. Uh, yeah? Whatever you do, don't let anything happen to that material. <laughs> of course not, dear. I'll guard it with me life. Shame about the kite, Nasha. But it wasn't big enough anyway. No, what we need is a big sail so we can go really fast. <coughs> Dad, I want to make a sail for my skateboard. Got any ideas? Why, <sighs> what? to it, we'll both be in big trouble. Come on, Nasha. We've got to get back before Mum does. Yeah! You dreadful little gutter snipe. Total lack of discipline. I blame the parents. Oh, where's Mum's material? <laughs> Uh, sorry about that, Colonel. Sorry? It's taken me years to get this so perfect. Years! And now look at it! Ruined! Um, I, I couldn't possibly have me sail back, could I? No, you can't. I'm confiscating it. It's a danger to public safety, and so are you! But you can't do that! It's not yours! Can't I? Watch me! No! Wait! Hello? Dennis, where are you? Are you bringing that material back? Yeah, I'll be right there, Dad. Just uh, um, having a chat with the Colonel. Oh, right, Nasha, this is getting serious. <laughs> well, might as well get some use out of it. I've always wanted a hammock. <laughs> Magnificent! 
magnificent. That's well out of order! Right! Surely he doesn't think I'm going to fall for that old trick. So the little ruffian wants a battle of wits, does he? Well, he's going to find he's bitten off more than he can chew. He's so clever. Let's see how he copes with this. Come and get it now, if you dare. <laughs> he hasn't reckoned with your mighty munch power, has he, Natcher? <laughs> And I know how to get there without him seeing us. <laughs> have to stay calm. <laughs> stay calm. <laughs> breathe. Don't forget to breathe. <sighs> hmm. No sign of him. What's he up to, eh? We must be there. I can feel something. We'll have to get it out the way. Go on, Nasha. Do your stuff. <laughs> Find something to block it. Oh dear. would love to help, wouldn't you? Of course, Dad. Go and get the material then, son. Oh, no. Not that one. What? I changed my mind. I thought we'd have this one instead. What do you think? Not a t- 
tent. If you want to go camping, Dad will take you. Won't you, dear? Oh, uh, yes. Uh, oh. Yahoo! Nasha, we're going camping! Yes, yes. Fit. I used to be top scout in the Beano Town Wolf Pack, you know. Yay! Camping is going to be so cool! So, what did you do in the Beano Town Wolf Pack, Dad? It was brilliant, Dennis. Living outdoors, finding our own food, recognizing all the different plants and animals. <gasps> really? What's this called? Oh, well, that's a. Uh, uh... That, that, that's a rare specimen, actually. Uh, let, let me What's think. that tree called? Yeah. And that bird? What well, kind of grass is this? What's that, Dad? Stinging nettles? Funny, that's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> Oi, look what you've done to my bivouac. Your bivouac? A bivouac is a shelter made from branches, leaves and moss. Oh, I thought it was just a funny-looking tent. Tents are for softies. I made that myself. Name's Tough. Terry Tough. Well, it couldn't have been much good if it broke so easily. Bet my dad could build a better one. Oh, you think so? Yeah, he knows all about that outdoorsy stuff. He was top scout in the Beano Town Wolf Pack. Was he now? I suppose you're an expert at bivy building then. Absolutely. Possibly. Uh, I might have missed that meeting. But, Dad, I, I thought you said... But, yes, I do know a thing or two about the great outdoors. Go on, Dad, you tell him. Really? So, you wouldn't mind proving that then? <laughs> Not at all. This your tent? Yes, but I... Now put it back up. I'll build a new bivouac. See who's quickest. <laughs> Looks like one nil to tough, Nasha. <laughs> now, let's see how good you are at fire lighting, eh? Oh. <laughs> it's hard work, this. Of course, you know how to make herbal tea. I think Dad might have been exaggerating the whole Top Scout thing. <coughs> Not at all. In fact, I'm just getting warmed up. What's next? Way to go, Dad. You tell him. What's next? Oh, I think I've got just the thing. Bring it on. That's Mount Beano. First one to the top and back is the best outdoorsman. Agreed? Agreed! And one other thing. The loser leaves the campsite and never comes back. Well, if that's how you want it, fine. Are you sure you need all this stuff, Dad? <sighs> A Beano Town wolf cub should be prepared for anything. <laughs> See you later. Don't get lost. Wow, he's fast. Dad, we'd better get moving if we want to keep up. Dad? Just checking the direction, Dennis. Now, was it the wet finger into the wind means north? Or... Let's just head for Mount Beano. Or was it see which way the grass blows and divide by the angle of the sun? I can't remember. 
Oh, well, uh, l let me think. That? Ah! Oh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, 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 oh back off, Billy. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, oh, 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 oh. Gives me an idea, though. I don't believe it. They're gaining on me. But if something was to slow them down, by accident, of course. Oh, I'm suddenly very tired. Must be the mountain air. Goodness, was that me? Oops. <laughs> it didn't look so high from down there. Come on, Dad. We're almost at the top. Just don't look down. You're right, Dennis. Don't look down. Mustn't look down. Dad! <laughs> Greasy hair oil and mum's silky face 
cream. Time to test out my latest gold fast oil masher. To dramatics, Nashi. <laughs> Wait until I tell your father. Mmm, pizza would be great, Mum. What? What? What's Dennis been up to now, Sergeant Slipper? Well, he uh, he, uh, he, uh, he ran over my Woof. foot and. Uh... Nashi, you know Dad doesn't like you eating out of his hat. What are you talking about, Dennis? Hmm. You know. He might have had a bit of a bump on the head. You think? Uh, maybe you should, uh, well, you should take him to the hospital for a once-over. Yes. Well, I suppose I'd better. Looks like we buffed our way out of trouble again, Nasha. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. No, not you, Nasha. Pets aren't allowed in hospital. <laughs> So, what do you think's wrong with Dennis, Doctor? Hmm, his um, odd behaviour could be due to his fall. It had better be. Oh, this place is no fun. I wish Nasha was here. <laughs> Nasha! Could have sworn at... Let's get Dennis to the X-ray department. A quick scan should confirm what's going on up there. Hey, watch it! I'm not well, Mum. <laughs> so, how is Dennis, Doctor? Hmm. Extraordinary. It appears your son has swallowed a dog. Nasha! <laughs> Come away, Nasha. The doctor says Dennis needs total rest. No, I just need to go home. Well, out of the question, I'm afraid. We need to keep Dennis overnight for observation. Overnight? But, but... That's fine, Doctor. Dad! You heard what the doctor said, Dennis. Come on, Nasha. Time to get you home. <laughs> now, the rules of my ward are no pets, no chocolate, no TV, no computer games and no... Fun! This place is worse than school. No complaining. You're here to get better, not to have fun. Hi, Dennis. What? Walter? Do you know Walter? Yeah. Unfortunately. Well, he's quite the star in our hospital radio. Yes, I'm their best volunteer DJ. Tune in to Walter's Radio Marathon tonight. It's going to be jazz-tastic. Ciao. Oh, why didn't I just fess up and take the punishment? It couldn't have been worse than being stuck in here with DJ Walter. Now, Dennis, if you need anything, just buzz this buzzer and I'll come running. You will? Cool. Yes? Could I have some water, please? Certainly. Could you pass me a comic? What about your water? Could you... Anything else you'd like me to do before I buzz off? No, thank you. I hate this hospital! Oh, hang on. 
Meatballs! Me favourite! Here you are, Walter. Let you keep you topped up for your radio show tonight. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Shame there's only steamed cabbage left. <laughs> Catch you later, listeners. Nasha, good to see you. <laughs> Quick, hide. <laughs> Can I go home now, Doc? No, I'm afraid you aren't going anywhere for 24 hours. But there's nothing wrong with... That is, I feel much better. Honest. Rest is what you need, and rest is what you will get. No, I need to go home. Mum and Dad will be missing me. Oh, it's so peaceful without Dennis under our feet. I've told your mother and father that you'll be under observation until we see a real improvement. Improvement? Him? <laughs> Sounds like you'll be in here a while, Dennis. <laughs> That's it! We're breaking out of here now! Hey, you! Stop! No dogs allowed! Oops! Time to go, Nasha! Stop! fit into that. You don't need to. It's a bed bath. A what? But, but, I had a bath last month. Wait! I... Whoa! Oh, that's... Freezing! No dogs allowed. Though he is still very tired, he'll need much more rest. Oh, you could say that to Ready, Nasha? <laughs> Let's go! Playing by the rules is highly overrated. Unstoppable, unstoppable, yeah! They can hold us back. We'll make the most of every second. Yeah. 
to be grounded and stuck at home. Me neither. Look, Pie Face, there are plenty of things to do better than eating pies. There are? Yeah, loads of things. Come on, let's go and have some fun. Take your mind off it. Here, over here. <laughs> <sighs> together, but he's still thinking about pies. I know. I think it's time for plan B. Aversion therapy. Aversion? What? You'll see. Explain it to me again, Dad. Why are we giving him pie? We're not curly. See, if he takes it, his teddy bear gets it. <gasps> no pie face! Don't do it! <laughs> Oh, the Ooh. pie festival! 
<gasps> no! Oh, watch out! Sorry, Walter. Nearly crashed into your stall. Good job you didn't. I reckon I'm on course to win again this year. <laughs> yeah, yeah, whatever. Well, looks like we beat him here. How do you know? Cos no one's screaming, get off me pies! So, what now? Dunno, but I'll think of something. Ladies and gentlemen, soon it'll be time to pick the winner of the grand title, Best Pie in Festival, which should be uh, soon. Uh, when our chief judge arrives, that is. <laughs> You've got a plan, haven't you? Oh, yes. Going then, Curly, because here comes Pie Face. Okay, I'm on my way. No, Pie Face. No. <gasps> Pies. Right, that's it. Just wait till I tell your dads. You'll be grounded forever. Nasha, quick, Plan C. Walter out of the way. Now, I've just got to keep Pie Face occupied for a while. <sighs> oh, no, you don't! <laughs> Let me go! No! <laughs> all those pies! <laughs> don't worry. You'll get all the pies you want in a minute. <laughs> Yes, just a few minutes. I promise. Are you sure? Trust me. Have I ever let you down? <clears throat> uh, ladies and gentlemen, there's been a slight delay. Our uh, chief judge still hasn't turned up. I wonder what could have happened to her. Oh, I don't get it. I'm sure that curly-haired kid said the pie festival was here. Mr. Mayor, how about a standing judge? Uh, well, I don't know. Remember what happened last year? Oh, oh yes, yes, I remember. remember. Oh, remember. Oh, oh, judge, I get a point. Yes, but you have to admit, no one knows more about pies than Pie Face. Yeah, well, that's right. Pie Face, Pie Face, Pie Face, Pie. Oh, very well. Come on up then, lad. Yay! Yay! Oh, what do I have to do? Well, you just have to taste all these pies and tell us which one's best. <gasps> now, when you say taste. <laughs> <laughs> So, do we have a winner? No, I, I just can't choose. They were all so good that they're all winners. You saved the day. And as a reward, here are some special presentation pies. <laughs> 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 Their dog stole my best pie! That lot should be locked up, not rewarded! Oh. Well, dogs will be dogs. And you two did save the pie festival. I, I think we'll overlook it on this occasion. <gasps> <laughs> I don't really fancy any more pie for now. <laughs> we borrowed the extra loud speakers, Jen. Can we set up in the treehouse? Not yet, Pa. 
Pie Face. Mum and Dad are still here. I remember how they moaned last time we played. We could try playing a bit softer. It wouldn't be much of a video for the din makers then, would it? Anyway, Athena wants it loud. Now she thinks she's a music video director. But she did say she'd show it to her dad, Dan. Yeah. If she thinks it's cool, she's going to play it to Rat Bucket. And if he thinks it's cool, whoa! So, we better be nice to her. Now, I've just got to get rid of Mum and Dad. What? You said you were going off to a meeting. You said you were going to be gone all day. We are. It's a special meeting of the Neighbourhood Watch next door. For young people. The Mayor's coming. The Colonel says you must be there. He wants you to help him with his talk. It'll be a nice way to make up for the trouble you caused him. It wasn't my fault his window was broken. I insist you go. It's the only way he's going to forgive us. Now go and get changed, or I'll be confiscating that guitar of yours. What? <laughs> guitar? Not today! Nasha, you're going to have to warn Curly and Pieface <gasps> that we've been caught for this meeting, that it's next door, that we'll escape as soon as we can, that... <laughs> OK, I'll write a note. Just grab a trouser leg in your teeth and hold them till they've read it. <laughs> to be a fine young man years later. And we can only hope that that is the case here. Did you give him the note? Not... Was Athena there? Some of you may have heard of the mayor's new campaign. Young Street Heroes, it's called. Thank you, Sergeant. I'll do this if you don't mind. Yes, it's an award for youngsters who contribute most to their neighbourhood. Like our very own Walter, for example. Athena will be there by now. We have to go! And now, how youngsters can help protect our neighbourhood. Lights, please, Walter. Head for the toilet, OK? <laughs> how to recognise a bad type. First, notice the eyes. She texted to say she's going to be late. Oh, no! I'll have to get back then. Mum will go mad if she finds I'm not there. And Athena will go mad if she finds you're not here. Oh, I wouldn't want to be in your shoes. Thanks, Pie Face. Just let me know the moment she arrives. Right. I'll do one of me bird calls. Easy to slip back in the dark. That's right. Up you come. As I was saying, I've specially invited two well-known local hooligans to join us. Justin, one, two, three. And so, thanks to forward planning, the hooligans are disarmed. They're gonna start playing. If anyone hears them, we're done for. talking earlier about noise pollution, Colonel. Uh, can we give you a demonstration? Pieface, <laughs> <laughs> I think I see Athena. I can't hear you. Yes, yes, that's enough. Thank you. That's very good. All right. Quiet. Quiet! It's wonderful to be able to call on genuine troublemakers from the locale. In order Quack! To the steps, we are that means Athena must be there. We can't keep her waiting or she'll throw a wobbler. What are you doing, Dennis? Uh, you know, I needed the toilet before. Uh, well, I'll do again. <laughs> and so does Nasha. OK, Nasha, you wait here. If I'm needed, bark loudly. <laughs> Hi, Athena. What's happening? 
thing. You owe me one, Dennis. I'm missing my nail therapist because of these idiots. We're fixing it. It's just a small explosion type thing. Can't they speed it up a bit? <laughs> no. What? Not you. Uh, no. Yes, they can. And I'm going to help too. I think I saw a loose wire uh, under the stage. I'll be back in a minute. I'm warning you. Five minutes, then I'm taking my talent elsewhere. Give us a signal the moment you're ready. I'll do me owl. Oh, wait. What happens if a real owl flies past? It won't sound like yours. Yes, up here. Up here this way. Now, let's see what happens when a young hooligan tries to pick the lock on Walter's special lunchbox. I don't pick locks. I've never picked a lock in my life. Go on, try then. <laughs> Hilarious. Can I go now? <laughs> As you can see, that's one padlock that won't be picked. Ooh that's my face. We got to go. Dennis, are you all right? Uh, yeah, Mum, uh, but uh... oh, you're very hot for someone who's just been sitting still. Perhaps you should go home. Home? Yes. Uh, great idea. I'll come with you. Actually, uh, it might be better to stay here in the quiet. You go back to your seat. Oh, if you're sure. But I don't want to see you stirring from here. We've got to go! Athena will be going mad! His Worship, the Mayor! No! Oh, how do we get past that lot? It's amazing what you can do with a few paper clips and rubber bands. Yes, and uh, the elasticity is uh, really quite surprising, Your Worship. <laughs> it's okay, Poochie. It's only Nasha. <laughs> Millennium. It's okay. I'm gonna change. Start the intro, guys. <gasps> what was that? Aha! Hooligans! Till Miss Miniwoof's down again. <laughs> okay, I'll get it. And don't play, or she'll panic and fall. When she gets stressed, she needs soothing. And play something soothing. Today, they're noisy, antisocial, and they lower the tone of the neighborhood. Dennis, I am going to make an example of you. Yes, you, because you're not like the others. I heard the gentle music you were playing. I saw you rescue that poor pup from the tree. And I heard from your mother that you've not been feeling at all well, too. Come forward, young man. You and your faithful hound are young street heroes! Yeah! Young street heroes? <laughs> Not a bad name for a band. <laughs> of the Starship Enterprise. I have lost several crew members to a terrifying life form known as the Spoon. 
<gasps> What's that? It's one of them! I come in peace! No! <laughs> times have I told you, Dennis? Don't play with your food. You don't mind when Gran does it. Attention! Yes, well, she's only staying here until her foot gets better. That's right. Meanwhile, you don't mind looking after Harley, right, Dennis? Who's Harley? My hog. The pig. Sounds like fun to me. Can't wait to meet him, Gran. You will, when you go and feed him. Hey. Eh? Check out my glasses! <laughs> <laughs> Fancy mistaking a hog for a hog. A what? A pig for a motorbike. Well, that's the problem with the internet. You never quite know what you're going to get. True, but if she decided to keep the pig, why didn't she buy a home for it? You know, a sty. She did try to build a sty. And dropped a brick on her foot. Meanwhile, the pig's running around all over the place. Ah! Ah! Ooh. Uh -huh. You found Miss Bears. I wondered where they were. Ta! Right, I'm off to feed Harley. There's some leftover cabbage in the kitchen. <laughs> what a pong! Make sure he's got clean water. Will do, Gran. Come on, boy. Oh. All right. Stay and keep Nipper company. I'll see you in a bit. Come on, boys. Let's see if anyone's noticed that I put salt in the sugar bowl. <laughs> <laughs> OK, Harley. Here's your swill. <laughs> oh, <my. laughs> Stay <Steady> on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, mate. Yeah. See you later, then. Bye. Oh, no! The bucket! Uh, me again, fella. Just uh, come back to get me... <laughs> that little Dennis looks at it on the floor, all up the walls and all over his face and says... Me never wanted stupid birthday cake anyway. <laughs> really? Brilliant. <laughs> oh, that's great. That's another one. <laughs> oh, yes. Dennis was a real handful when he was a baby. Oh, hello, love. How's Harley? Oh, a bit lively, as you can see. Mmm, <laughs> smells nice in here. Oh, yeah. Gran made a pie. <coughs> Delicious. So, are you guys ready for band practice? Bring it on! Uh, isn't that my jacket? Yes, it's great, isn't it? <laughs> oh, time for a break, I think. Oh, yeah, I'm ready for a break. Oh, yeah, right. Oh. It's probably past Harley's feeding time. Eh? Oh. OK, Gran. Come on, lads. You can give me a hand with the pig. You go, Dennis. Your friends can catch up with you. Oh. Uh, all right. Uh, see you in a bit. I haven't played one of these since... Well, I've never played one of these. But it's never too late to learn. One, two, three, four! <laughs> Oh, here's some fertiliser for your rhubarb. What? Well, oh, thanks, Den. Wait a minute. I thought you were... Who's playing my guitar? <laughs> wow! I see your foot's better. Uh, oh, uh, well, actually, it doesn't hurt when I do this, but if... Oh, if I just walk like this... Oh, the pain. Right. I thought you two were too tired to keep on rocking. Oh, we are now. Your gran has even more energy than you do, Jen. Hmm. Come on, boy. We 
Let's go and read some comics. And there might be a doggy treat in it for you, too. <laughs> Gran, what are you doing? Oi! That was the last sausage! Oh, never mind. It's pretty much done. <laughs> Gran, you shouldn't make a fire in here. You could have burnt down me tree house. Well, I don't know about that. It took me ages to get it going in the first place. I had to use all that paper there. My comics! You said fire to... My comics! You don't need comics. I'll tell you a funny bedtime story. It's not my bedtime. Is it not? Ah, oh, well. We'll have a laugh in the morning, eh? Oh. Here, boy! Night! What? You can't stay here! This isn't a granny flat! It's my treehouse! My treehouse! <sighs> well, at least that's over with for this morning. Dennis! Your gran says don't forget to give Harley his chewable vitamin. Pesky pig, smelly swine, pot bellied pest. No! Hi, lads. What's going on? Just tidying up. Your gran asked me to. <laughs> what are you doing, Pie Face? Running up some curtains for the treehouse. Your gran showed me how. Right, that's it. I've had enough. If anyone wants me, I'll be in my room. <sighs> oh. Dennis. Curly, what are you doing there? Get away! Oh, I thought you were hanging out with Gran. I was. I love you, Gran. She's so funny. But she had me drumming for hours yesterday. I'm worn out. All this fun is starting to feel like hard work. Yeah, I know. And her foot is totally better. I think she's well enough to go home and look after Harley. But since she started hanging out with us in the treehouse, she doesn't want to leave. That's right, and I can't keep up with her and... She ate my pie! Not ya! Yes! The pie I saved for emergencies! <gasps> right! Heads together, lads! I've got a plan! I don't know why you've brought me back home. I was really happy in the treehouse. <laughs> this way, folks! <laughs> oh, wow! You built a sky for Harley! Brilliant! But careful! Mind your foot! Oh, oh! Um, actually, I think it might be getting better. Thanks, Dennis. That's okay, Gran. Do you think you're going to be able to cope all right? Harley's a bit of a handful. Oh, don't worry. I'll be able to handle him. Now he's got his own place to live in. So, where is this pig, anyway? I had to ask. Seriously? Get off me, you stupid pig! Hey, wait a minute. I recognise that sty. Didn't it used to be my shed? Used to be, Dad. Used to be. Dennis! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm glad we've got the treehouse to ourselves again. 